Welcome to the Great American Homestead. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the bell notifications. All right, well today on the Great American Homestead, we're going to sweep the chimney. Uh, we haven't we haven't done this since last year. Last winter, we were in the wood stove all winter, and uh, it's time to clean it before we use it again for this winter. Uh, you should. They say you should sweep your chimney every couple months, even during the winter, two, three months, if you use it continuously. I keep an eye on it, and we'll see what happens. Um, so anyways, I got this kit uh, off Amazon, and it's, uh, I think it goes up to 20 feet. It goes up to 20 feet. And that's plenty. Actually, I think it's like 23 feet. Plenty enough to get to the top of ours. Okay, so it's gonna like go there and spin. All right, so I think what I'm gonna do is disconnect the flute from right here uh, and clean up in there, and then I'll clean the inside of this, change out the. Uh, Firestones and stuff on a separate day. This goes in here. Ooh, look at that, guys. That's a fan right there. So, that's what we're gonna stick up the flute. Oh, wow. Yep. See that? Yeah, uh, we're going to grab a flash. Uh, I think it's by my bed on top of my dresser. I was using it last night. I was using it earlier. It's like uh, next Friday. Hispanic, the brothers and shit. Sure, As sure. As Q break in, he's like, hey, where's the duct tape? He's Ew. like, it's, it's in my room. I was using it earlier. So yeah, see that, guys? It's like a good at least half inch. Uh, I don't know. Korea's I feel like you're not. Oh yeah, we, we are getting good shot now. We're going to clean all that out. Uh, I guess. Ew, that's yucky. <laughs> Uh, hey, come grab this, uh, black shoe thing, move those and put it here. Or you can set it over there, just set it somewhere else, not to do it. Alright. So, there you see, a decent amount. Already a lot of it came out, but we're gonna give it a brush. Ow, 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 fuck. That's nice. That's gonna bruise nice. Try Round number two. two. <laughs> Shit. 
we need safety glasses. Pretty good, guys. Holy, that looks so much so better. So much better. It's real quick. Brand new. And one more time, let's look at your arm without all that oh. gunk in the background. Where is your arm? Oh. Whoo. All right. So now we're going to clean the top part. And uh, Scott, maybe like a couple feet here, a couple feet in the attic, eh, maybe like three or four feet in the attic. And then uh, it comes out the roof about four feet. So, uh, it looks just as bad. Let's try and get actually the camera and the flashlight up there. Let me hold the camera. You let it go. Yeah, see all that, guys? We're going to get all that out. It's built up nice in some spots. Yeah. Mmm. You moved it around, that was real good. Yeah, right there. Yep. Wow, that's disgusting. Okay. Alright, it's about to get messy in here, guys. Put your safety glasses back on. Let's see. Alright. Oh, oh, uh. Bring me a piece of cardboard or something to cover this. Oh, the bottom? Yeah. Alright, our new yep. journal. Cool. Yeah, it's fine. Hmm. Ooh, already so much is falling. That is ah! crazy. Yeah, have fun vacuuming later. Ooh, you guys see all that that fell out? That's crazy. That's crazy. And I only went up. Like four feet. I think each one of these is like four feet. Three feet. It's three feet. Oh yeah. Better? Uh, I can taste it. It's in the air. Yeah, uh, come look. It's crazy. Look at that difference, guys. Wow, yup. Look at all oh, that cleaned up. And then you see where it starts up again where I didn't get to where I couldn't reach. I'm about to continue on right now, but you saw how that was and you see how it is now. And this is everything that's fallen out. Oh, yeah. it is in the air here. Gross. Yeah. That's about it. <laughs> Ew, don't touch your dirty ass fucking hands to your beard. Ah! Because my hands are already dirty. Dude, my skin is so tough. A lesser man's skin would have shrimp. Okay. Ooh, look at all this. We finished. That didn't take long at all, maybe like a half hour. Uh, real quick and easy, so we're just gonna assemble this middle part that we took out. And I'm gonna slide it in 
the bottom first. So I got it upside down. I'm going to slip the female into the male end. The male into the female end. I'm going to slip the male into the female end. And then I'm going to bring this down and slip the male into the female. I'll pay him. Boom. And that's it. It's back up and running. Uh, I do, I'll tend to the inside of the stove, but pretty much it's ready to go. Because most of the creosote builds up in the flute, so that's your primary concern. That's it. Real simple and easy. Oops. And also, guys, of course, um, all the decorations that we have here, we have them just because we're not using the fireplace at the moment, but as soon as we get the fire up and running, we are fully aware that that is a huge fire hazard and we'll get them down. So you guys aren't concerned for us. <laughs> we are? Oh, whatever. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and turn on the bell notifications.